Hello everyone, my name is Alan and I'll be showing you a great addition to the Unity desktop environment on Ubuntu 14.10 and below. This is a weather gadget, fully customizable and is quite accurate depending on where you live for it to search your location. This link will be provided in the description below. Just scroll down through the page, you can read the information about it. There are also terminal commands, but I'll be using the deb installation. So click on this link, download. When you arrive at this page and you're a beginner and you don't know what to do, just go to the last one at the bottom, click on this one, save it to your downloads. I already have it downloaded. When you do have it downloaded, you should see the file .deb. Make sure it has the word extras in that whole line right there and just double click on it and install it with the Ubuntu software sensor. I already have it installed, but when you see this, click on install, type in your password, wait for a moment and you should be good. Now to open up the program, just search in the Unity dash by clicking on this button and search there, weather. You should see my weather indicator. Now when you open it for the first time, you will have the settings open up. In order to have your own location, in order to see the weather, what's happening, click on search location and up here type your location. For instance, I will be searching for Diddy Guam and when you see this here, double click on it, maybe four times you double click or twice you do it because sometimes there is a little bug there. So you double click on it and then you click on OK. If there's an issue, you may have to do it twice and it should change the name and you have your, lo your location. That's a little bug. Now the next step is to go under widget options and check mark the box that says show widget. That way you can have the widget on your desktop. I suggest also showing it in your taskbar which is up here. This is where you can always modify the settings. The reason I say that is because when you have the widget open you can't right click on it. So this is why I say have it at the top. Or the other way is by going to the unity search dash and open it up from here. That may not work sometimes. The next part I'll be showing you, um, you can go ahead and tweak around the settings. You can either choose on all desktops by that. By that I mean when you have workspaces open by pressing start menu S on the keyboard, it won't be on the next workspace. However, for my personal preference, I prefer it to have it on all my desktops. The next part I'll be showing you will be the skins. You can go ahead and look around the skins. Um, here's a little screenshot on how all the skins look like. That way you won't have to select them one by one. They also show it on the OMG Ubuntu website. I believe you can have two weather indicators by clicking on the second location tab and it will search and you can tweak around with the settings just as I said earlier. So if you click on OK, it should refresh your widget and now there will be two. It may freeze for a little bit, maybe a couple seconds, but after that you should be able to move the widget around. That way you can have two widgets. You'll notice that you have two weather indicators on your panel. Click on preferences, um, go to second location tab and then uncheck mark this box to disable it and hit OK. It should refresh the widget and you should have it back, just having one. You can go ahead and tweak around with the rest of the settings. Um, if you want to change your temperature uh, metric system, my own is the Fahrenheit. Uh, for pe other people in different nations, they have Celsius. Um, I use Fahrenheit. You can check it out here. I like to use a 24-hour time format. You can select the icon theme, and you can set the refresh to every 15 minutes, uh, one hour. I would go 15 minutes. But the most vital part is the general options tab and check mark the box that says auto start. That way when you log in on Ubuntu, it should auto start every time you log in and it will have the weather indicator. Again, if you do have issues, just wait for a couple of seconds and it should respond. If you do have other issues, just log out and log back in. Thank you for watching. My name is Alan. God bless. Hello everyone. My name is Keep, 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 keep pushing this